What if we don't have enough? I would die. I would die if we didn't have enough. So this is the half bath and I need to find just a cool like piece of art or a shelf, something cool to put on here. All right, I made a run for it in the rain and I regret it instantly, but it's okay. Over here, I feel like it was a sign I'm not gonna find anything, but let's try it anyway. thing that I found was $200. I think I can make it. It might be pretty cool DIY also. I really came here to like solve a problem, not create more problems. So it's been a couple of weeks and I've been sick, if you can't tell by my voice, but I am determined to do this DIY. I think it's going to be so cute and I've had some time to like prepare for it. Um, so anyway, I've got a piece of foam board, I've got little, I think these are like pins for like whenever you get your clothes altered. I've got a hole punch for butterflies and I've got some white thick construction board and paper and then I've got my fabric so I'm gonna put the fabric on the foam board cut out the butterflies and stick them in like that's it it's like a three-step process <laughs> um, so yeah I'm gonna cut some of the butterflies out first because that's gonna be like rewarding <laughs> and then I'll glue the foam board we'll see how it works I need to make sure that the pins and the butterflies like look good together too so let's go all right camera only has 13% battery because I'm a professional so I'll have to switch to my phone at some point but okay let's cut out the butterflies first one ah he's so cute okay <clears throat> these are gonna be a lot littler than I thought they were gonna be in my head but that's fine it's a quick little $50 DIY. I do wish that they were bigger though. Okay. Pin. Stick the pin in the butterfly. I'm gonna warp it. I need like a thimble for this. I'm just gonna murder my hands. I guess I can just stick it. Ah ha ha. Pro tip. Yeah, and look like that. And then it'll just stick into the foam board. <sighs> it's gonna work. Okay, next question is, is this a pop enough? And that answer might be no, but <sighs> it's okay, it doesn't matter. It's really not that important. It's the idea that counts, okay. trick. The trick is just sort of put one down on the fabric, punch it in, boom, move it off to the side, you're done. So much easier than like picking each one of them up with your hands. All right, it's the next day because I had to give my fingers a break from pinning a million of the butterfly thingies, ding, doohickey, whatever we're gonna call them. Um, and yeah, that was exhausting and tiring and it took hours. Um, so much so that at separate points, 
my husband and I were each like, this is not worth it. We should have just bought the $200 thing. But anyway, up next is the fabric. I'm gonna hot glue it. And yeah, I got two yards of it, which is way too much now that I'm looking at it. But whatever. It is what it is. <clears throat> I'm sure it would be smart if like we ironed it. I'm not doing that. That was way too much effort. So. <clears throat> Crabbers. Okay, I'm probably gonna hide it anyway, so it doesn't matter. Okay. Here we go. <coughs> Does not need to have that much. But let's see. I swear if the hardest part is this fabric, I'm gonna die. I wonder if I should be doing this a more efficient way. Official way. Okay. Ah. Oh. Cruds. Okay. <coughs> uh oh. I know, kiddo. This is gonna work out. It's going to work. Okay. Okay. one edge at a time sort of thing like how do we I'm gonna say yes okay <laughs> you were doing so good what happened what happened all right they burnt themselves call that a win Super tight. Super tight. Who cares? Okay. Let's do the other end. Oop. Ow, fuck. I knew it was gonna happen at some point. It's only a matter of time you burn yourself with hot glue. It's okay. Who invented hot glue? Someone said, hey, let's make this glue hot and that'll make it better, more adhesive. It's probably a scientist, a chemist. Here, yeah, coming up truth. I'm scared. Ta da! All right, not bad. Not great, but not horrible. All right, in the original piece of art, um, all of the, the butterflies were like clustered in the middle. And I'm thinking I don't want that for this one. I think I wanna do like a circle, like a blank circle in the middle, have all the butterflies be around it and then sort of scatter. So I have two size bowls. I've got a little bowl, too small. And I got a big bowl, actually, which looks good. I'm not gonna measure. We're just gonna like roughly measure. Size of scissors. Move up a little bit. Okay. Yeah, whatever. Roughly. Okay. This is gonna be our middle. And then we're just gonna take butterflies, start placing them around. Okay. What if we don't have enough? I would die. I would.
this is how it looks in the bathroom. I think it looks so cute. It's exactly what I wanted and it blends in with the wall. Oh, 